Welcome to Quick Finance, Jacob. I have some news for you today. You do not want to be this guy who lost his password to his wallet, his crypto wallet. This goes to the point of you should always pick strong passwords, but passwords you can remember as well. Because if he does not get this money back, he's lost $200 million today. But given the way Bitcoin is, potentially billions. I feel really, really bad for this guy. Stefan Thomas, 7,000 Bitcoins. Oh my gosh. This is sad. But be safe, but be smart as well. Anyway, where is Bitcoin at? Over the past week or so, it's come back down from its highs, consolidated. It's looking at that nice 200 moving average and 20 moving average as well. Yep, it's definitely in the consolidation phase. When will it leave the consolidation phase? We'll find out pretty soon, maybe. Look at the RSI, low to strength index is below the 50 so definitely if it dips below that 30 or 20 i definitely see a lot of people buying bitcoin a lot of that mac indicator continues to you know show sell signals if it goes down 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 i definitely see a lot more people buying into this what is obzefa sa and what's the hype around it recently well according to the wall street journal that's five buy ratings, one hold, one sell. But look at that price target over the next 12 to 18 months. A median of $8, so it could double per what the analysts are saying. You're probably asking, what do they do though? What do they do? Let's find out. It's in that sector that Kathy Wood keeps talking about. Kathy Wood from ARK Invest. Kathy Wood, the investment guru. Kathy Wood, the genie. That healthcare industry that she says could go up 10, 20, 30 fold over the next decade. That's what they're going into. Research and development for therapeutic treatments for women's reproductive health and pregnancy. Given the birth rate in the Western world is so low, I could definitely see a lot of people taking interest in this company. Let's look at the chart the past week. People got interested. It shot up drastically. Let's look at the month. Not too much. Three month. Not too much. It's had highs though. It's broken six in the past year. It's broken 15, so it definitely has a lot of room to go back up and reach its potential. SNDL, the pot sock that my co host talked about a couple of weeks ago. It's still positive for the month. However, after that Georgia election, it started to cool off a little bit. If it goes down to this 50 cent range, again, I would definitely consider buying it. And then DM. Did pretty well the past week. It shot up, consolidated. Let's look at how good much it goes up. It's doubled the past three months. This is when Kathy Wood was investing down in here of ARK Investments. Three of her index funds are over 100% last year for growth. So I think she knows what she's talking about. If she's buying into the stock here, it was definitely a good investment to make as we see. Should we buy now? I'm not buying now, but if it goes back down to the 8.7 range, I definitely plan on buying more of this 3D printing stock. Tesla, what happened to Elon Musk? He was the richest man in the world for about a few days or a week, but Tesla came back down. However, I definitely see Elon Musk reclaiming this richest man in the world this year at some point with SpaceX and Tesla. And everything else going for him. Dog coin. Take a look at Ride. 
I bought the sock about a month ago. I'm definitely happy that I did. It shot up recently, and that's consolidating. But I definitely see it continuing to go up. Workhorse, same thing. A lot of potential of this company, especially with the UPS contract. Anyway, this has been a quick finance Jacob episode. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you.